Hello everyone, welcome to Park Mess. In this video, I am going to evaluate the value of 2 raised to power 20 minus 50. Now to solve this question properly and step by step, first we will write solution and then we will rewrite this question in the solution again and we will try to solve it. So the question is 2 raised to power 20 minus 50. Now in the second step we can write this 50 as we will write 2 raised to power 20 as the same and we can write 50 as 49 plus 1. Now in the next step we will change this 49 to its exponential form or power form. So we can write this equation as 2 raised to power 20 minus 49 can be written as 7 square because 7 times 7 is 49 plus 1. In the next step, we will multiply this negative sign inside the parenthesis. So this equation will become 2 raised to power 20 will be the same. Then it will become minus 7 square and it will become minus 1. Now in the next step, we can write 2 raised to power 20 as 2 raised to power 10 times 2 minus the remaining question will be the same. Now here in this term we will use a famous exponential math property. So here we will use this exponential math property a raised to power m whole raised to power n can also be written as a raised to power m times n. So by using this exponential property in this term we can write this equation as it will become is equal to 2 raised to power 10 whole raised to power 2 minus 7 square minus 1. Now my dears look into these two terms 2 raised to power 10 whole square minus 7 square. This is a famous algebraic identity a square minus b square. So here in these two terms we will use this famous algebraic identity a square minus b square which can be written as a plus b times a minus b. So by using this famous algebraic identity in this equation so this equation will become is equal to so here a is 2 raised to power 10 and b is 7 so it will become 2 raised to power 10 plus 7 times 2 raised to power 10 minus 7 and we will write this minus 1 here now we know that 2 raised to power 10 is a famous number which is equal to 1024. So here we will replace 2 raised to power 10 with 1024. So this equation will become 1024 plus 7 times and it will also 1024 minus 7 and write down this minus 1 is the same. Now let's simplify these two expressions. So it will become 1024 plus 7 is 1031 times it will become 1024 minus 7 is 1017 minus 1. Now there are two approaches to solve this question further and do this multiplication. One is the normal multiplication to multiply these two numbers but here I will use a trick which is very simple to multiply these two numbers. So let's learn this trick that how can we multiply such a four digit numbers. So first we will change these two numbers to this form. We can write 1031 as 1000 plus 31. And similarly we can write 1017 as 1000 plus 17 
and this minus one will be the same. Now first we will multiply one thousand with one thousand, and then we will multiply one thousand with seventeen. So let's do this multiplication. So one thousand times one thousand is one million. Plus seventeen times one thousand is seventeen thousand. Now plus. Now we will multiply thirty-one with one thousand and then thirty-one with seventeen. So thirty-one times one thousand is thirty-one thousand. Plus. Now we will multiply thirty-one with seventeen. So seventeen times one is. Seventeen. We will write seven, and we will carry one from seventeen. And seventeen times three is fifty-one. Fifty-one plus carried one is fifty-two. So it will become five hundred twenty-seven. And we will write this minus one. Now let us add these two numbers and subtract these two numbers. So we will write the remaining question as the same. So one million will be the same. Plus, let us add these two numbers. So, seven plus one is eight, and one plus three is four. So, it will become forty-eight thousand plus, and five hundred twenty-seven minus one is five hundred twenty-six. So, finally, let us add these three numbers. So, we will start from ones. Six plus zero plus zero is six. Two plus zero plus zero is two. Five plus zero plus zero is five. We'll add a comma. Eight plus zero is eight. Four plus zero is four. Zero and one. So finally, one million forty-eight thousand five hundred twenty-six is the answer and solution of. This nice math problem, and last, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for such a more interesting math videos. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. See you in the next video. Bye bye.